I do not see where it says shake before opening. What is this? Yodeldeldeldeldeldeldeldeldeldeldeldeldeldeldeldeldeldeldeldeldeldeldeldeldeldeldeldeldeldeldeldeldeldeldeldeldeldeldeldeldeldeldeldeldeldeldeldelde
Uh, but the chemical taste, oh yeah, I know. I was gonna say, I'm probably not the best person to take their advice on this beverage. If you do in fact like some of the uh, Java or coffee um, energy drinks. I just am not a fan of them. I was hoping that the Swiss chocolate was going to give it a more rich chocolate flavor and kind of eliminate some of that metallic uh, chemical taste and that actual, um, you know, monster energy drink taste. So one more sip. I've rambled on long enough. We're going to take another sip and then uh, give it a rating. Yeah. I won't finish that can, but again, there might be some people out there that enjoy this. I think there's only 19 grams of sugar in that where compared to like a regular energy drink, you're getting like 30, 35, 38. Um, so I think that might be an issue with me because I do like things sweet. Case in point, what do I have on standby? Yeah. I went a little different today with this little side note. Three pumps of mocha, one pump of the coconut caramel um, Girl Scout cookie flavor, three sugars and four cream, and it's a banger. Yeah, so um, back to the matter at hand, Java Monster Swiss Chocolate. We're gonna give it a rating. I hope Travis is having more success than I am. Uh, not sure if I mentioned it, but you know how these team-ups work. Uh, we're launching these at the same time. And then uh, you're checking my video out. I'm gonna have his linked in the description. I don't call it a collab, even though we are in collaboration on this product. This is a team up. I coined the phrase team up. It's what I use. Everyone else can use collab. Unless you're sitting in the car next with me, you are not collabing. It's my opinion. But uh, all right, enough again. Let's rate this, shall we? On a scale of one to 100, with one meaning don't even waste your money, and 100 being the promised land of who? I'm going to give the Swiss Chocolate Monster Java a rating of... I hate to do this, but this is like a 33. Tried to keep a nice little fresh number, a 33. Something you'd see on Sesame Street, the three and three together. Again, I don't know what that means. I do not have enough sleep. What does that mean? Sesame Street 33. Uh, it's a 33 out of 100. I won't buy it again. I won't finish this can. But again, you may drink this and think it's the best tasting Monster Java that they have released. I do not. We'll just leave it at that. So uh, there you go. Another review in the books. Please like, comment, share, and subscribe. Also, please do not forget to check me out. I do uh, Instagram. I do Twitter. Not sure how much longer that Twitter Always throwing a monkey wrench into my monkey wrench. No, always throwing a wrench into my plants. What? All over the place. Um, yeah. So in closing, no more 8.30 a.m. reviews. In closing, the Swiss Alps, it's a nice can. It's a beautiful picture. It's a nice thought. And speaking of thought, um, I want some Dutch chocolate milk. If anyone out there knows where to get my hands on a carton of Dutch chocolate milk, I don't know the brand. I'm going to Google it. Dutch chocolate milk. That's a review. All right, bonus footage. Sip. Sweet goodness. Sip. Oh, that just emphasizes it. Drinking the nectar of the gods right before uh, you take a sip of this. And again, I'm stressing it. Someone like me, someone who prefers the sweetness like this uh, over the chemical like this. And I'm sorry, monster. I'm sorry. There's people out there that probably like this. I'm not one of them. I don't know what else to say, but doing that back to back... A belly to belly, not enjoying it.
What is up, everyone? It is the endorsement, and it is time for another review. This is where I try something and tell you if you should like it or not. I can be very persuasive. Teaming up with Trav Tries. Travis over there in Arkansas, uh, we are teaming up on this 